All right, Anthony, you just picked Notre Dame. I guess tell us a little bit about the thought process that went into that and why you wanted to get that out of the way so early in the process. Uh, you know, I, I got up there and I met with all the coaches and, you know, the staff and everybody up there. And, you know, it took me out of school. I just fell in love with, you know, the beautiful campus and, you know, so many things to offer up there. And you know, it was a whole great experience. I just felt, I felt at home there when I got there. You had some pretty good schools, though, that were trying, like, you know, and still probably are going to keep trying to get you, you know, tell you Notre Dame's not good for you and all that. But why why do you feel like this is it, that they can't offer you anything that Notre Dame can't? Uh, you know, I, I, I sat down with my parents and my, my coaches, and, you know, we talked about like, all my options. And obviously, I have my top six schools, and, you know, we've considered it all. And, you know, Notre Dame's obviously the best fit for me, and that's why I've committed. And, you know, everything they have to offer as an education, football wise, and, you know, it's just the best fit. I don't think any other school has everything that they're offering me. So. I've seen you play since you were a sophomore, but for people that haven't, um, what, what's what gone into just making you the player you are today? Why do you feel like you've been able to reach this point? Uh, you know, coach, my, my defensive line coach, Coach Marty, he's done me since my freshman year. You know, he's been coaching me. So he, he's definitely been a, a big help in my success in Columbus. And also Coach Trujillo, you know, he's the one who brought me up. So they've definitely brought me into the program was, was, you know, a lot of help and, you know, doing a great job with me and coaching me very well. So they're definitely a huge part of my success. Let's talk about the season coming up. I mean, Columbus has been close the last few years, you know, had successful regular seasons. But what is it going to take for them to get a little further this season, you know, get that big win that's been a little you know, elusive the last few years? You know, we, we, we always have a great season, regular season, but, uh, Playoffs always come, and we always uh, seem to do not as well as we we can. But uh, you know, it's gonna you know it's gonna take us to do you know we're gonna have one to have to have one of those perfect games that we have in the regular season that we just dominate the whole team. That's we're gonna need one of those games, and that's how we're gonna be able to roll through the playoffs. If you know, we play as a unit, and, you know, no penalties, no no mess ups, and I just have a perfect game as a team overall, and that should. Do the job. We have the you had one of those, like almost one of those games. I know when you almost beat Northwestern in that regular season game. I mean, how much did that do just for confidence, just to know that you know we can beat these guys if we execute till the end? Yeah, you know, definitely you know, lose by two points and it hurts. But, uh, you know, it's definitely it's like a, a goal that, you know, now next time we got to score that extra touchdown, we can't have that extra penalty, we can't have that missed field goal. You know, we got we to gotta execute everything that we're, we're, we're set out there to do. Talk about your teammates this season. I mean, what do you have? I mean, what's the team looking like so far? I mean, some of the guys with you on defense. You know, it's a lot of young kids out there, you know, a lot of kids who've never played a varsity game. So it's, it's going to be a, a good uh, first interesting game. You know, it's, it's going to be really interesting and see what, uh, what the kids can do. And especially myself, you know, with, with a whole new team pretty much, you know, I've, I don't have Tommy Heffernan back there anymore with me. So it's, it's definitely a, right. it's a whole new system I'm going to have and a whole new group of kids. So it's definitely going to be a something to look for. On offense, there's some changes too. I mean, one of the big changes was obviously to Coy Sumler, you know, coming in. I mean, talk about what he's going to bring to the offense this year. You know, he's one of the, the fastest kids in the nation right now, so it's definitely a great thing to have on our side. And, you know, he's definitely going to bring, you know, big plays to our side. And, you know, look for him with the ball. It's going to be dangerous. You know, look for two guys covering by one, so it's going to be dangerous. <laughs>